In this video, you can learn how to unlock files quickly and easily using MCO Unlock It Freeware Tool. Files copying, moving, and deleting are among the most common operations we do on our computers every day. Yet at times, even those basic operations may be quite challenging if files are locked by a system or running processes. Windows does not indicate whether a file is locked. But when we try to delete the file, the operation fails if the file is locked. Unfortunately, in many cases, Windows doesn't provide enough information on what causes the problem. It only reports that the file is in use by another program, and we have to guess what this program may be. To avoid all those problems and unlock files and folders quickly and easily, you can use MCO Unlock It Freeware Tool. Let's see how it works. To check if a file is locked, we can drag and drop the file into the program. When the file is checked, we can see that a lock is detected. To unlock the file and delete it, we can click the Delete button. Now we need to make sure that the file has been deleted from the file system. As we can see, the file isn't available anymore. Thus, you can use this approach to delete any locked file. Alternatively, there is an even simpler way to manage locked files even without opening the program thanks to MCO Unlock It, which integrates corresponding actions into Windows Explorer. Here we have another locked file, so we can unlock and delete it directly from Windows Explorer. We only need to confirm the file deletion while it is performed by MCO Unlock It. Then the file is unlocked and deleted by the program at a single step. MCO Unlock It can help you in getting detailed information on file locks. Here we have files we need to check for locks. Let's check them in the program with a single click. All right, here we can see that one of the files is locked, but what is the program that locks it? To get an answer, we need to open a dialog that provides us with all the details. Here, we can see that the file is opened in another program, and now we know what that program is. So, what can we do to unlock the file and to be able to move it to another location? We can close the process locking the file and can do it directly from here, but there is another option available to us in this case. We can close the file handles to unlock the file without closing the locking program. It's a less intrusive approach, so let's use it. Now we can check if the file is locked. As we can see, the file isn't locked anymore, so we can move it to another folder in Windows Explorer. If you need to manage multiple locked files and folders, it's very easy to do it using MCO Unlock It. So, here we configure the resources we need to manage. Once the resources have been added, the program checks them to determine if they are locked. In the previous cases, we managed to unlock resources used by other programs, but there are many types of locks used on Windows, and the program allows managing different lock types. Here we can see all the locks discovered for our resources. By switching to the Permissions tab, we can see the resources that cannot be managed due to insufficient permissions. The program can unlock those resources by granting the required permissions. On the Shares tab, we can see another type of lock detected for shared resources. Those locks are created by Windows when you set up network shares for file system resources. To unlock those resources, the program needs to close their share handles. In this dialog, we can manage each lock directly, but there is an easier approach if we need to unlock all the resources, so we can close the dialog for now. Here we can delete or unlock all the added resources with a single click. Let's unlock the added files and folders. We can see that all the resources have been unlocked, and now we can copy, move, or delete them on the file system with no problems or difficulties. Would you like to unlock files and folders quickly and easily? Download a free copy of MCO Unlock It.